Hello friends, welcome to PharmaRox. In this video lecture, we will make the solution of Pharma Quiz Part 4. PharmaRox, the way of success. Let's check the instructions for the quiz. First of all, we welcome you in the PharmaRox, a YouTube educational channel. In this video lecture, we will solve pharmacy related MCQs. MCQs it means multiple choice questions. Here are the quiz rule. There are a total 10 MCQs. Each correct answer carries 4 marks. Incorrect answer will lead to deduction of marks. Negative mark is minus 1. Time limit is 15 minutes. You may pause the video for noting down the answer and resume the video for knowing the correct answer. Comment your score after completion of your test. You may subscribe our channel. Subscribe our channel for more educational videos related to GPAT, NIPER, DI and pharmacist exam. Here we upload the pharma quiz. So let's start the quiz, solve the questions carefully. We provide you answer after 5 to 10 seconds after MCQ. Here is the question number 1. Pseudoephedrine is a option A erythroisomer, option B thioisomer, option C mesoisomer, and the option D is racemic mixture you may pause the video and note down your answer so correct answer for this question is option c mesoisomer so pseudoephedrine is a mesoisomer let's check the question number two Choose one appropriate therapeutic use for imipramine. Option A insomnia. Option B epilepsy. Option C bedwetting in a children. And the option D is mania. You may pause the video and note down your correct answer. So correct answer is option C bedwetting in a children so bedwetting in a children is a complication and for that treatment we can use the drug imipramine so appropriate therapeutic use for imipramine is in a bedwetting in a children's let's go for next question question number three active metabolite of Spironolactone is option A aldosterone, option B candrinone, option C corticosteroid, and option C B pregnenolone. You may pause the video and note down your correct answer. And the correct answer is B candrinone. Correct answer is B. Candry non. So active metabolite means the active form of that drug and spironolactone's active form is a candry non. So the drug and their active metabolites are usually asking competitive exams. So this is the important topic. Let's check the next question. Number four. Which among the following is a Mucoadhesive. Option A HPMC. Option B Eudrazid. Option C Ethyl Allulox. And the option D is Zeldrite. You may pause the video and note down your answer. So, correct answer is option A. HPMC so from this given four options HPMC is used as a mucoadhesive polymer and used in various tablet formulations 
question number 5 is active form of minoxidil is option a minoxidil acetate option b minoxidil succinate option c minoxidil sulfate and the option d is minoxidil citrate you may pause the video and note down your answer the correct answer is c minoxidil sulfate minoxidil subset sulfate is active form of drug minoxidil so let's check question number six the hlv value of sodium lauryl sulfate is option a 6.5 option b 13.8 option c 25.0 and the option d is 40 you may pause the video and note down your answer so correct answer is option d 40 so hlb value of sls is the highest and it is the 40 let's check the next question question number seven chloramphenicol comes under the schedule of option a schedule w option b schedule p option c schedule j and the option d is schedule h pause the video for think the answer and the correct answer is schedule h let's check the next question zymosine are inactive form of option a enzymes option b genes option c lipids and the option d is vitamins you may pause the video and note down your correct answer and you can also make the comment of your score after completion of this quiz so give the answer and also make the comments after completion of your test and if you have any query related to the questions and the answer key you may also comment in a comment sections so let's check the answer of this question so zymosines are inactive form of enzymes so correct answer is option a enzymes so zymosines are inactive form of enzymes let's check the next question number nine smallpox vaccine contains option a living virus vaccinia option b living culture of bcg option c living virus hepatitis and the option d is attenuated staphylococcus you may pause the video and note down your correct answer in your notebook then you can make the self-evaluation of your test correct answer is option a living virus vaccinia next question number 10 ovary is present in option a crown option b hypanthium option c salix and the option d is corolla you may pause the video and note down your correct answer friends if you like our content and the quality of them secures you may comment in a comment sections and you must subscribe this channel for more such educational videos this is the part four of this quiz series and you can solve the quiz number one two and three in our previous videos and the links are given in a description box so let's check the answer of this question answer is b hypanthium so ovary is present in hypanthium so the 20 questions are completed for this quiz so this quiz is organized by pharma Rocks. good luck and comment your score
like share and subscribe our channel for more educational videos PharmaRox, the way of success gpat niper di pharmacist exam preparation study material and model papers you may contact Mr. Amar Rawal, call or WhatsApp on 9016312020. Here are the package details, GPAT, NIPER, DI and Pharmacist exam. You can shop now these books. Payment mode is by the cash on delivery. PharmaRox, the way of success.